So in this specific case, let's just scroll down on the Apple website and find an image. So in this specific case, we see this iOS 15 image right here. Well, all we need to do is go ahead and just grab an image like this or anything for that matter. We'll get into this panel. Now, if I let go, you'll see that image is still there and it essentially allows me to add photos. I can copy the image, whatever. But because we want to drag and drop, all we really need to do is go ahead and grab this thing right here and we can go ahead and kind of swing it around everywhere. Now, at the same time, if you have a home button, you can click the home button. If you have a gesture based iPhone, you can swipe up and you can see I still have this image right here. Now I can go ahead and go into any other app and go ahead and drag and drop it. And you can see I just dragged and dropped it in here. And I technically have this image saved right there, which is so cool. Now I don't know if everyone's going to use this, but drag and drop is a really cool feature.